much for tuning in for this video. Today's video is going to be just a quick, super impromptu video. I ordered some eyeshadows from the Makeup Geek site, her Makeup Geek expansion kit, which is brand new. These are like colors that weren't released before and they're on sale right now for $39.99 for eight eyeshadows. So I got them super quick, like their shipping was super fast and I wanted to share them with you in case you were wondering what they look like or you know, just initial thoughts. So if you wanna see um, swatches of Marlena's new eyeshadows, then keep watching. All right, so I already have my hands swatched because this was a do-over. The first time that I was swatching these, first finger that I put on was this really dark color and then I wiped it on my forehead. So I had to kind of wipe that off. Then the third eyeshadow in, it kind of fell and it went underneath my couch. So I'm just gonna show them to you, but I already have them swatched. That's why I'm not swatching them like right now. Um, all these swatches are gonna be without a primer. So I'm kind of basically rubbing twice and just putting it on the back of my hand. So as you can tell, the pigmentation is really, really good. I ordered 10 eyeshadows in total. Eight were from that expansion kit and then I ordered two extra eyeshadows that I wanted to try out. So from the expansion kit, I'm gonna show you really quick this is the, one of the brightest colors, and this is called Razzle Berry, and it's like a really pretty red, like a brick red, with a strong micro shimmer running through it. And here's the name. And this one is right here. So it's very red, and it has that shimmer running through it. The shimmer is actually kind of like chunkier glitter, and the glitter does kind of travel migrate kind of like um, if you're familiar with Urban Decay like um, Chopper or Midnight Cowboy that kind of thing so um, this one I'm not too thrilled about the glitter kind of traveling the second one that I wanted to show you is called Poolside and it's coming up on my monitor a lot lighter than it is this is a bright gorgeous kind of aquatic turquoise color and it's right here it's super pigmented it's not powdery at all um, it's just beautiful. I love this color and again, I hope that it's not coming up this sky blue because it definitely is darker than that. Next here I have Shimmer Mint. And this is a beautiful minty light green. It's right here and it has a strong kind of golden shimmer running through it. It's definitely one of the most metallic ones and one of the most um, neutral ones. It's more of, you know, you can use this definitely every day and stuff like that it's definitely a very wearable color very very pretty um not powdery the one that i have that i have on my inner corners of my eye is chicka d and it's a beautiful orange yellow and this one is a little bit powdery but it comes off really really nicely right there I kind of had to reapply it because you know that's a problem with powdery eyeshadows unless you have a sticky base that kind of fade a little bit this one that I have is beautiful this is called Envy Envy is a blackened emerald green I'm gonna show it to you in the back of my finger I think that maybe see how beautiful yeah I wanted you to see the depth it's beautiful it has a little bit of a shimmer running through it kind of like very refined shimmer is what I'm trying to say it looks kind of almost satiny it's beautiful, very, very pigmented. This is great for kind of crease Next, work. I have the most neutral one of all of them, and this is called Moon Dust. And Moon Dust is like a taupey shade, like a, a taupey brownie shade. It, this one is extremely pretty as well. Here it is. It's beautiful, and the pigmentation of this one is wonderful too. Find the metallic ones kind of are a little more creamy, whereas the mattes are a little more powdery, but that's pretty much every eyeshadow that I've tried, so. So this, this one right here. Then here we have Sensuous. I'm probably saying that word super weird. But here's Sensuous. Here's the color. It's like a blackened plum purple. It's really pretty. I have Unicorn and unicorn is like a cornflower blue. It does remind me of like That unicorn blue <laughs> And the pigmentation of this one is really good too and this one definitely comes off matte and I would say this is one of the most powdery ones next to chickadee It's one of the most powdery ones this one right here 
so those are all the colors from the expansion kit. And then super quickly, I wanted to show you the two shades that I picked up individually. The first one is what I'm wearing in the inner part of my lids, and it's called Wisteria, and it definitely reminds me of the color of Wisteria. It's a beautiful kind of pastelish, medium, like lilac color. And this one is definitely a little powdery, but it has really good color payoff, I have to say that. And lastly, I picked up this one. And I couldn't resist to pick up something a little more nude. And this is called Purely Naked. And I picked this one up because on her site it's compared and swatched right next to Grain by MAC and I don't have that one. And it was really, really similar so I figured, you know, I'd save myself some money. Um, it's a really pretty kind of like transitional color. I love this type of color just to do work on other people and just on myself. Um, so yeah, it's right there. It's really, really pretty. So those are all the eyeshadows that I picked up. I just wanted to show them to you really quick in case you were curious or yeah, you just wanted to see people's opinions on them. Let me know if you have any questions or anything like that and I'll be back very soon. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you're having a great day. Bye.